do this. Hello, everyone. Let's do this. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> I'm here in San Diego with my new friend, Evan Rock. Please check out his YouTube channel. What is it? Uh, you can find me on youtube.com slash fruitzen. Fruitzen. Yeah. Dot com. Okay. Yeah. And well, I'm really happy because it's... When I got into this lifestyle, I never imagined that I would meet so many wonderful people and make connections and just have fun like like it it's just it, we've had a great yes we've had a, so yeah a great fun. time it really has and even well, though it's overcast it's like <laughs> inside where, where the sun is shining yes exactly scoop a doop scoop yes. scoop the, the sun is shining here Bob Marley reference yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice <laughs> So, I want to know a little bit more about, I want you to tell my viewers a little bit more about yourself, where okay. are you from, and mm -hmm. uh, kind of your experience. You guys know that I went from Rebel to Raw, and I used to be a big party girl, and now I'm not, mm -hmm. and all of those things that I used to do before, and I feel that you experienced kind of the same thing before. Yeah, yeah, I grew up so, in LA, um, grew up in Malibu actually. And a lot of kids with money and time on their hands, and uh, we definitely partied pretty hard. And um, basically, I told you a little bit. I, I broke my arm snowboarding really bad. That was the beginning of my health journey. I think, looking back, you know, hindsight's always twenty twenty. But uh, that led me to yoga because I started having like back pain and shoulder pain. So I wanted to, you know find alternative ways to, to relieve that and yoga makes you flexible not just physically but mentally and you can start to accept other alternative lifestyles and ideas that seem pretty unconventional and I eventually found veganism and raw veganism and in that journey eventually came across 801010 but like Yovana, I'm a cannonballer. I jump in the pool. And so like when I cool. first heard about it and kind of got the concept before even getting the book from, you know, being shipped in the mail, yeah. I was eating mono meals of fruit and like, let's try it because yeah. experience is the best teacher. And so I did that and I started feeling amazing. I was always somewhat <laughs> under the impression that carbs were bad. And when I started finally Definitely. feeding my body and my brain carbohydrates, it was like the curtains were pulled back. I could see clearly. I could think clearly. Definitely. I could. I had all the energy. I had too much ener energy, actually. I started doing triathlons <laughs> and running races, and I had like no prior fitness <gasps> history doing running. Wow. And I started hurting my legs because there's just no tendon or ligament strength that's had what, been that's built what's up. That's happening to me too. Yeah, you gotta yeah. be careful. You gotta. Yes. You gotta really pace yourself. Yes. You're not superhuman. You exactly. Know? And I have but like, you feel like you are. Like you yeah. feel like you have so much energy. So much energy. You just want to totally. do it all. And it's not the kind of energy that you get from stimulants, which exactly. makes you feel kind of hollow, you know? It's, uh -huh. more, it's more of a just, you know, wake up and feel amazing day in, day out kind of energy, you know? That's really I'm always cool. surprised. Like I go to bed and I'll be so full, like a huge sweet salad with like, thousand fifteen hundred calorie meal and and then I wake up and I feel light and exactly. I'm like let's do this and let's do it again and it's like yes. wow I get to pig out and really just enjoy food that is delicious yes. and so good. feel good at the same time it's yeah. almost it's that's what it should be because we have a symbiotic relationship with fruit trees and this is what our bodies were physiologically designed exactly. to consume exactly therefore minimal I don't know discomfort minimal <laughs> downtime you know yes so that's great well you look really healthy and you look like you're really thriving on this and Thank you and you have a lot of energy and that's really great that you pulled away from that environment it's not easy because it's yeah it, it's really easy to get sucked into that well one thing it's I was talking to Ryan in an interview before this and it's okay, like, if you pull away and you 
explore health and then you come back and you make some mistakes again. Mm -hmm. But as long as you get a taste of what it's like to, to live a healthy lifestyle for at least, you know, a couple months where you really commit to doing it, that's enough to motivate you for the rest of your life Definitely. because then you'll be chasing that, you know, you'll be chasing that high. And when you go back and you get the hangover, or you eat food that makes you feel like crap, you move back towards the stuff that made you feel great. And mm -hmm. you just, you might ping pong a little bit, but exactly. you'll eventually, your compass bearing, you know what is going to get you to your destination. Definitely. And that's what's important. Yes. So. It's, it's great to try it because, and it's great to try it and really feel the benefits. And then maybe you go back, but you always know what you need to do to feel good. Like yeah. that's, it, it's not. It's, Doug Graham says, it's like, I could give you all the steps mm -hmm. that would get you in the right direction, all the transition recipes and all these things that would be the next logical step for you. Mm -hmm. Or I could just tell you what's the compass bearing that's gonna get you to just Japan. To, and you know, if I give you slightly off, you're gonna end up in Australia because the journey of life is like sailing a boat and you want the exact compass bearing that you should continuously move towards. Definitely. That's great. Stolen idea, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Analogy. No. It, it, it really makes sense. Yeah. It does. So thank you so much, Evan. Yeah. Thanks for, for having me on your... the show. Yes. Ravana. Yes. <laughs> Let's like do this, guys. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, thank you all for watching and have a wonderful and fruity day and see you next time. Bye.